everybody and welcome to the part number 20 of Let's Play Sprinkle of Life. It is Christmas time, so I got myself a new skin just for the winter time and I fully decorated my house with Christmassy stuff and it's all looking so cute. My house has never looked better. So I'm using a new texture pack. It is a mixture of the one I had before, but with Jolly Craft and Beauty Craft. The links for those will be in the description. I also was able to enchant all of my armor with Protection Free, and it's now resting on this armor stand just for now, because we're gonna have a pretty chill part today. I'm getting into the Christmas mood. We're gonna be probably cooking and just building stuff. It's, it's gonna be fun, different for sure. So what we're doing today is something that I've been wanting to do for a while and I told you guys about this. When I first moved into this world, I'm planning to open up the Stacy Wolf shop in this part. So I already laid out the layout. Good. <laughs> Good English. But I already sketched out what I wanted to do, I guess. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. You guys get what I'm saying. Uh, right over here, I penned out like how big I wanted it to be, if it was gonna fit or not, and I, I think it will fit. And what I'm thinking about doing is, I'm gonna try to make a mini version of our house in story mode. Stacy and Stampy started a series some time ago where they tried to build their house from story mode a game, and I guess I took some inspiration from that, and I'm gonna be building a mini version of it because we don't have a big plot of land to work with. And inside the shop, of course, Stacy is gonna be selling SDX bonds for her mod, the Stacy Wolves mod, since I have in my game, the Mo Creatures mod and the Cusimob spawner mod, which is actually the mod that is causing all these issues. Because of those two mods, uh, the Stacy Wolves don't spawn in the world, so I guess opening up a shop with her selling the eggs is more fair for survival gameplay. So, I'm gonna start building this right now. And let's see if we get this done quickly. So first, we're gonna buy some sand from the looks here that he loves. And we're also gonna need some sugar to purchase some clay. And also, before I forget, I think I have here the dye that I need, which is light blue, to get that beautiful blue colored clay. I did have to tweak the color of the clay a little bit in Photoshop because it was a little too dark. I couldn't find a blue that I was happy with, especially one tone of blue that would look good with dye right. So I, I tweak it a little bit, but it's the same texture, guys. I'm gonna buy some clay from Candy. So I forgot sugar, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll be right back. I have sugar over here. I just completely forgot to bring it. Uh, here we go. Here we have the sugar. And now, Candy, please give me some clay. Uh, I'm gonna buy... Maybe two stacks? That's more than enough, I think. Hello, Candy. Uh, let's get two stacks of sand. I mean, that's gonna be more than enough. <laughs> Thank you, Dorothy. And now, I think we are ready to start. I'm gonna put the sand to smelt over here. Put some more coal inside the furnace. And let's see. So I'm all done building the exterior of the shop. The doors are super Christmassy, so they look a little bit off with all this blue, but with how long it takes me to edit every single part, Christmas will be over in no time. <laughs> now for the inside, we're gonna have to have a counter, uh, we're gonna have to put Stacy in, and we're gonna have to... I don't know, I kind of want to put a carpet on the floor, but I don't know how that's gonna work. We're gonna have to see that. So I'm gonna go get the wool and I'm gonna get the materials to make the counters. If I don't have some built already, I'm gonna go see. Do I have any counters I free? Okay. Maybe we could make one more. We just need one more block of quartz and I also need uh, some, not light blue. I already had light blue clay. No way. I need cyan, that's what I need. Oh my gosh. I made so much light blue. That, that's okay. 
Good to know, good to know. <laughs> Let me go put this away. I actually moved my nether stuff to somewhere else. I decided that we needed a specific area for us to brew our potions and we also needed a place to plant our nether wart. So I thought we could build a little secret room on the other side of the portal. So that was exactly what I did and I freaking love this room. And over here we have the quartz. I've been collecting a ton of it, so it shouldn't be an issue. As you can tell by the map, I've been doing a ton of sprinkle paths around the map. Uh, I I've been working. I feel like this is kind of boring to do on cameras, so I've, I've been doing it a lot. We have a path over through here and now it connects over to our main path next to the farms. And these two guys still haven't gave me an egg. I'm getting really worried. <laughs> you guys don't like each other? Is that it? Should I get another ostrich? I can get another ostrich. I don't care how far I have to go, I'll get you another one. Sheesh, guys. Let's see. Uh, I have a ton of light blue. I kind of want regular blue, so I'm gonna take the regular blue. And we need more whites. Uh, shears, which are almost dead. Uh, blue, blue, blue. Here's my blue, and where's my white sheep? I have two. Uh, four wool. Well, mm, here's some sheep. I'm just gonna shear you for some wool, because I need it. Thank you very much. I already sheared these guys. <laughs> and there goes my shears. Well, well, so I'm thinking, well, these are indoors are gonna be a blast for me. <laughs> Because I adore high indoors. I'm gonna take down the floor, that's what I'm thinking of doing. All around here and maybe over here on the back. I wanna make a striped rug because it's Stacy we're talking about. Uh, it needs to be striped. Maybe not like this, but maybe. Okay, it's gonna take a while. I don't have my shears. Maybe horizontally, just so that we have more stripes going on. And now the blue. Boom. And the counters are gonna be... We could actually only have two. We could. <laughs> I made four for nothing. Well, maybe for the future? Yeah. Yeah. I should also start thinking about making more food. Maybe some Christmas related food because I'm running out of food. And I would like to cook some delicious things for Christmas because it's Christmas and I, I eat really delicious stuff on Christmas. <laughs> I don't think we have any of the stuff that I eat in the game and in any of the mods that I have here, uh, but we could take a look and see what we have available for us to cook. I honestly don't know whether other countries eat on Christmas to celebrate it. What do you guys eat for Christmas? We have a ton of things here in Portugal that involve cinnamon and sugar and just a lot of sugar, pretty much. <laughs> but it's so good! Let me actually see, do we have any... Um, The thing is that I don't know how to write any of the recipes we have here in English. Avanados, <laughs> that's not a thing. Sonhos. Which translates to dreams that uh, does not exist. Uh, pudding? Is pudding in here? Ooh. Uh, Yorkshire? No. We make French pudding. At least me and my mom do. It's our tradition. Do they have codfish? No, that's not a Portuguese thing. <laughs> uh, do we have... Do we have fish sticks? Because I'm actually not a big fan of... Oh! Okay, it's not these fish sticks that I eat, because I think these are shrimp. Yeah, not exactly this what I'm talking about, but good job, good job. Because I, I don't really like codfish. What do we have? <laughs> what do we have for Christmas? Nothing? Is that what you're telling me? How am I going to celebrate my Christmas without food? That's what Christmas is all about, food. What about cookies? Do we have any cookies? Um, peanut butter, raisin. This would be kind of Christmassy. I don't know if you guys have uh, the tradition of when it gets to 
the New Year's Eve. You take dry raisins and you, I think you eat 12 and for each 12 you make a wish. So when there's a countdown for the New Year, in every second you eat one raisin and with each raisin you have a wish for the New Year's. I don't know if that's a thing anywhere else. I think it's kind of silly because how the heck are you gonna make every single wish in every single second? I, I just eat them all at once. <laughs> And you drink some champagne and that's New Year's. We could make this. Like, th I guess this is the most Christmas thing I have here in the game. That's, that's where we're gonna get. We need bakeware, which I think I do have. We need flour, wheat and a motor and pretzel. I have, oh my gosh, it's nighttime. <laughs> oh no. Oh my gosh, don't leave me in the kitchen. What are you doing? Up on, oh. What mob is that? It has a cute shirt, a cute Christmas shirt. I, want, I need to see it. Don't die, don't die, let me see you. He died, didn't he? <laughs> no, but you had an ugly Christmas sweater. I really wanted to see it. Do we have any other mobs around? <gasps> Look, the skeleton has a little Santa hat and spider is just a spider. That, that's exciting. <laughs> Okay, raisin cookies. Here we go. Uh, let's go get some wheat, uh, which I don't have much because I made so much hay bales. Um, let's take this. This will be enough. 60 cookies. I don't know how much they're gonna fill me up, so let's make a ton if possible. Um, this, and now I need a crafting table. Okay, okay, here. I made a ton of flour so that we don't ever need to make it again. Or maybe I'm just gonna use it all. Uh, we also need the bakeware. What else? Uh, eggs. Oh gosh, 60 cookies. We need 60 eggs. Do I have that? I don't think I have that. Uh, no, I don't think that's gonna happen. I have these many and I probably have a few more on my cook, but we don't have much. Uh, let me go take all of this with me. I'm gonna leave these behind. Oh, <laughs> we need more eggs, guys. Work hard. Come on. What else we need? Uh, we need sugar. Okay, let me turn back. <laughs> let me get the sugar. Uh, here, full stack of sugar. We have a lot of sugar cane. I oh, got more eggs. Thank you, guys. You sure are working hard. And now we also need. Uh, okay, that's true. I was worried. What's raisins? Oh, uh, grapes. Uh, I think I have grapes growing, but what we can do is uh, grab some bone meal, if I have any. I don't think I... Well, I, I have a few. I'm gonna take the bone meal, and I'm gonna bone meal that up and see if I get 60 grapes. Actually, I don't think I need that many, but just a few grapes. Yeah, they're right over here. Oh, we get multiple. Okay, let me do this uh, a few times. Now we need to cook them. So, well, let me take out the glass. Grapes over here, grapes over there, grapes everywhere. Let me go put this in my storage area. Uh, let's put the glass over here, there. Uh, okay, let's wait. <laughs> do, 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 do. We can already make one. Okay. Uh, so it's the bakeware, the flour, the egg, the sugar, and not this, the raisin. There! Uh, let me go get all of this out and let's eat. Ooh, they're actually pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna wait until all of this is done and I make all my cookies. We're gonna need a lot of food and supplies for winter. And here we have the raisins. It's actually the next day for me, guys. I got bored of waiting for this to get cooked. <laughs> but, but guys, I did do something while I was in here. Uh, I did a little search 
uh, about the ostriches to be more specific. And apparently I've been doing something wrong all along. I, I knew I had to be missing something because those ostriches, they just haven't been breeding with each other and I, I, I just don't understand. And it's kind of hard to find stuff about this mod because I'm playing with an old version of it, so... Dude, I don't know if it's uh, regular seeds or if it's melon or if it's pumpkin. I'm gonna take one of each and we're just gonna... We're just gonna do a little spin and see which one works and if we get an egg. Because I want ostriches. Please. <laughs> Let's go see. Okay, guys. I need to feed the female. You like seeds, not these? Do you like... She ate those. Okay. Now we wait. I don't know how long this takes, but she actually ate the melon seeds. Oh boy. This is exciting. Very exciting. Hello, Candy. <laughs> I wonder how I'm gonna pick up the egg. I guess I should have worried about this uh, some time ago, but I didn't. <laughs> Um, they're gonna attack me. That's gonna happen, guys. Uh, oh god, she's getting near me. Uh, oh, 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 that's a beautiful egg. No, I wanna, I wanna pick up the egg. I need to pick up the egg, and I'm probably gonna die. Ah! Run! <laughs> I have an ostrich egg! I did it! I'm so sorry. I'll keep the baby near you. I promise you. Oh, oh. Okay, let's go take the egg to the, to to the hatching the nursery area. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I feel so bad. But you know what has happened? We added a person to the nursery. Oh yes, we did. And that person is Nunny Sims. So welcome to the world, girl. You're gonna be here and you're gonna help us uh, just tame all of these birds and reptiles and it's gonna be fun. It is. We have so many. I don't have space for new ones. I guess I'm gonna take these out and put the ostrich egg over here. I'll see what I'll do here. I need to organize this better. Uh, but, but yeah. But she is not the only person I added to the world. How are you guys? Are you guys still mad at me? I'm sorry. Don't, don't kill me. <laughs> Don't kill me, please. So now we know it's melon seeds they like. Over at Stacy's shop, I already set everything up and she's already here. And, oh god dang it. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Curse you iron doors. Uh, let me in. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, she's here. She's not alone. Uh, it was very hard for me to pick two wolves because I don't want to crowd this place with too many wolves and lag that's also a concern of mine so uh, I got here Tucker and I got here Basil because they're wife and husband and I, I figured they should be together so uh, that's why I'm gonna sleep and so they're gonna be working here with Stacy and just like Stacy they're also gonna be selling the egg spawns because there's so many for us to buy and uh, Stacy just couldn't hold all the deals with her, so yeah. We're gonna come here later in this part to actually get a wolf. I know what a wolf I want first. It's gonna be so cute. Uh, but I also added someone else to the world. Yes, I did. That I did. Uh, I figured that I really needed some saddles for my horses and it's kind of a drag to keep crafting them, so I made here one. And somebody is gonna be selling them at the tiny stables. So we can go there and we can buy some saddles from Ava right over here. So you've been at it as well. Uh, do I have my... it's probably in my chest. Uh, here, the NPC wand. Let's go uh, make you a trader. I'm gonna put here the saddle. I need to make a price for the saddle. It's probably gonna be gold because we need to give our artists some business around town <laughs> she's the one who sells gold and if i ever need it i'm gonna come to her because i didn't i'm not alone that apartment anymore not at all i've been doing pretty well so let's do 10 gold or maybe nine that's equivalent to a block just will be a little bit tough to to get the saddles sell saddles for nine gold 
and I think this is gonna be good for us. I might decorate this place a little bit more, but for now it's gonna stay like this. And yeah, I actually need to buy s some saddles. I don't know how many, let me actually go see. Because I did breed the horses that I needed to do, and I have here all of them. But some of them need names, so if you have any name suggestions, they would be really appreciated. Uh, we have your carrots, and we have Angel, uh, we have our Zebra, which needs a name, and we have here our Horse X, which also needs a name, it's our little Dal Dalmatian horse, it's so cute. And we have two more pens to fill up. Uh, I've been getting the Essences, Essences, the Hearts, I still don't know how to craft the Essences. Uh, I know we need to read the Zebra. Uh, with any horse. It can be any horse. We could try to do that now. I just need uh, two more saddles for these two horses. Yeah. So I'm gonna buy two saddles and then I'm gonna see which ones I'm gonna breed and let's see if this works. Let's see if we get a horse. And for now I might only get uh, one fairy horse if possible. Even though I took a look at, uh, at a few of them and uh, the skeleton horse was one that I was actually looking into because he's so cute and we can get him in with wings so he can fly around but I think he's super slow so maybe that's not our best bet but it's just so adorable. I'm probably gonna build a, a base. I'm not sure where. At first I was thinking of building a cloud over there and put the horses on top of the cloud but I don't know. I'm gonna need to see what I'm gonna build exactly and I need to plan it because I want it to look good. But for now, we're just gonna have to get one fairy horse. That's gonna be it for us, guys. Uh, oh, it's nine. Oh, shoot, I only brought eight. <laughs> no, curse my bad memory. Okay, let's get the second saddle. And we have two. Now I'm gonna go to my horses. I'm gonna pick which ones I want to breed. Um, it's gonna be the zebra and maybe I'm gonna breed the zebra with carrots, maybe Yeah Okay, okay, you two are gonna breed then and you get a saddle and You get a saddle, okay uh, So I'm gonna take you guys out for a little walk Let's go zebra. So we're gonna go inside here. You're gonna stay uh, do I have pumpkins? I do. I think it's just pumpkins to breed the two more creatures' horses. Um, and now let's take Carrot with us. He was already going. Here you go, buddy. Let's close the gate. And now we're gonna put you together with our zebra. And I really hope we can really pick any horse. Uh, zebra said yes, so I'm trusting him. Uh, so here's the carrot. Uh, a pumpkin? Carrots? What? <laughs> it's early, that's the problem. It's too early for me to function. Okay, guys, give me a baby. There's a zebra on the back as well. <laughs> is that gonna be an issue? Hopefully the other zebra is far away from the breeding area because there cannot be anything near them for them to breathe. Oh, the zebra is gone. Oh, it's far away, okay. We are good. Come on, guys. Give me a little baby horse. A Zors. That would be adorable. I might also get a donkey later. I might, because that would be really cute. Look at me doing all things that I've never done in Minecraft. I'm finally doing them, guys. Finally. <laughs> like, I had so many series in the past, uh, and they all went wrong because of mods, which just were conflicting and uh, either broke the world or the mods were conflicting with each other and things weren't uh, function normally. Here, I'm really making an effort to make everything work. <laughs> and I'm proud of where we're getting. I'm getting things done that I never really got done before in Minecraft. This is really exciting for me. <gasps> I'm gonna call you... Twinkle Bud. Hello, buddy. You are a source. Oh, I need to now see how we make the fairy horses to be exact. I I think we need to go above cloud level, um, but I'm not sure about the, the rest. Uh, we also need to make the essences, which I still haven't done. I think to make the essence of light, we need all three of these. Uh, this one we need an inner portal. 
We can try to make these already. I'm pretty sure we can. Okay, I'm gonna get that going and let's see. Just so that we have things ready already. Um, I have, I only have one ender pearl. One. We have one shot of this. Uh, one heart of darkness and what's the other thing? A bottle. Uh, I have a glass over here. I think I made way more than the ones that I actually need. <laughs> Well, we have one Essence of Darkness over here. And uh, next up, let me go see. How do we make the Essence of Fire? We need Blaze, uh, Heart of Fire, and Glass Bottle. We have one Heart of Fire. Uh, I don't think I have things over here, so I'm gonna need to go down. What else do I need for the this one? A uh, Run and Flash, which I have uh, some over here and the heart of the undead okay cool cool let's go down uh i have fire over here so i might use fire and i have no crafting table over here okay let me take my one out uh we have here the fire essence i should actually see how the horses look like um with these essences we can also do this with the ostriches which is so cool uh, for the Essence of Light, uh, it's this one, this one, like this. Yes, we did it! I think this is all we need for the fairy horse. How exciting is this? Um, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna see. Uh, the horse is probably gonna, gonna grow. We're not gonna do this today. Uh, but it's good to know we already have this, because this is pretty hard to get. But what I want to do now is get a donkey. I really want a donkey. And I'm gonna get one. Uh, if I had any apples on me, I don't. I don't have any apples. Okay, going back. We're gonna need a lot of apples for the rest of this part. Uh, I have here some apples. Let me get a few more over from this tree. All done, and now we go out into the world and we're gonna get a donkey. Uh, I should get a saddle, I should. So saddle, here we go. And now, I know there's a donkey somewhere through this side, I have seen him before. I have, oh uh, there's a fox with my cows. You better not kill any of them, or I'll murder you. I know it's Christmas and all, but I will. <laughs> Are you guys still mad at me? No? You guys are- oh, okay, no, 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 you guys are not okay. <laughs> uh, is that my donkey? No, you're not my donkey. Where's my donkey? I've seen one. A long time ago. Um, please tell me it's still here. <laughs> please! My only donkey! Uh, hello? Where are you, man? Where are you? What's up with this tree? These two trees, they are so weird. Oh, okay, I, I see. There's a tree ant stuck in them. So that's probably what happened. No, we he couldn't have left me. I'm gonna be such a good owner. None of my animals have died yet. <laughs> Just putting that out there. It's really important. Where's my donkey? Could have went onto the back of the doggy castle. I don't know, I guess we could go take a look, because that's where I last saw him. Okay, we have a zebra, a horse. Where's my donkey? Donkey? Elephant? <laughs> we found an elephant first, but not, not a donkey. What the heck? I should have gotten him while I had chance. Now I can't find him. I'm not leaving until I find one. God dang it, Poison Ivy. Don't tell me Poison Ivy got him. No. My donkey. He was over here. And now he's not. And I'm very sad now. Because, oh. Where am I going to get another donkey? It has to be around here. Oh no, it's a zebra. I thought I heard it was a donkey. <gasps> donkey! I found you! Donkey of my dreams. Come, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> what are you doing? 
I've been looking for you everywhere. Take all of my apples. You deserve it. Not that goat. Please, please let me love you. Let me love you. Please. I'll be a really great owner. I can promise you that much. <gasps> yes, donkey. Who is a good buddy? Oh. How's my little baby Zors going? Is it still a baby? It looks like it's still a baby, Twinkle Bud. Okay, I might actually keep the name. <laughs> it just brings me joy, and that's what Christmas is all about, joy, right? Okay, let me go open up the gates. You're not coming in, Fox. No one harms my horses. Uh, you're gonna go over here for now. I actually want to talk a little bit about my Christmas plans right now for the series. Um, I was thinking about building a gingerbread house uh, and make some snow golems, but the thing is that uh, snow golems are not really meant to be in the biome because it rains here, it doesn't snow, and if it rains, the snow golems die. Um, so I don't know if I should build over here or if I should build somewhere else. I actually found a really pretty place. Uh, I can take you guys there. Uh, but it's this one over here. It's really pretty and we could build like a little train station and just uh, ride the train over to there. It's not that far away. But also, I don't know, if I were to build here where I'm at right now, uh, it would be right over here in this area, in between the sprinkle puffs and my farm. So right over here, we could have some animals and uh, maybe over here we could build a little igloo or even open up a shop or a stand where we could be or where someone could sell some hot beverages or maybe some ice cream because it, it's cold. But the snow golems, I don't think they could live here. Unless, actually, if we uh, built a little cave over here. Because it looks like a little cave, <laughs> looking from here. If we had a little hole over to this place. It, it could work out, I guess. Maybe. But I don't think I could build the gingerbread house over here, it's too tiny. But the place I was looking into was... Uh, over through this way, going through our stables and across them, over to this side, uh, crossing the water over here, over to the grove biome, and right next to the grove biome we have a snow biome, so uh, we're not that far away from it. Uh, it's, it's kind of a long trip, but at the same time not really. And if we build a little train, it would be super adorable to travel back and forth. Is that a village? Ooh, I actually did not see that. Uh, the place I'm trying to go to is over for that way. And we have a ton of ravines close to us here. But as you can see, we have a snow biome right over here. And it's very beautiful. And we have a village over there indeed. Okay, I'm gonna go take a look. Because we don't come across villages every day. Especially in this world. Oh, look at all the kitties over here. Are you kidding me? It was so hard for me to find cats in a few parts ago. Okay, here we are. Huh. What a lovely village. With a little fox that is trapped in a hole. How nice. Oh, it started raining. Oh no, but this is actually perfect because now I can see where it rains and where it snows. Because we need a safe place for the golems. It's too dark in here. I'm leaving. <laughs> uh, this is a little hot. Do we have a blacksmith? Oh my god. Oh my god. No, no, no. I don't have any armor. I'm probably gonna die. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. I don't have any armor. This was going to be a shield part. A shield part. <laughs> There's so many mobs around. I see you, Skelly. Oh my gosh. We're so dead. We're so dead, guys. Get inside the house. Get inside the house. Quick. Get in here. Oh my gosh, are you zombies? Ah, this was a big mistake. Can I sleep? Oh, but I can sleep then, if there were no mobs around me. 
Oh, I slept. It's still raining though. We should go back home. <laughs> Let me just teleport back home and go go to sleep. Goodbye, guys. It's for the best. It's for the best. We may part. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was terrifying. Well, I guess maybe we should take the armor indeed. Give me my armor. Give it back. Jesus Christ. Well, uh, here we go again. <laughs> so we go across the table. You cross to the other side over to the group biome. <laughs> There's a zombie. Hello, zombie. Burn. Burn, baby, burn. There we go, give me the random flash, that's actually really handy. And right over there we have a village, let's go see the village. <laughs> it's my first time seeing it, oh my gosh. It looks so peaceful on the map, no red dots. I'm so excited to go see it, oh gosh the red dots are showing up. Uh, not excited, not excited in the slightest, in the slightest. Uh, do we have any blacksmiths, because that's what I'm interested in, either that or, or a library. That's what I want, really. What's over here? What's inside this cabin? Nothing? Let's just see what they're trading. That's not a good trade, bud. <laughs> not a good trade. Ooh. Oh, the bunny came for the carrots. Or maybe it's just the wheat, I don't know. We may never know. Oh my god, so many crops. Just laying around. Well, I guess we, we go. Let me take you to the place I was talking about. It's just a little island over there. And I just figured it would be so cute to build over there. But at the same time, I don't know. Like, this is the island I'm talking about. It's very tiny. Uh, but we could make it bigger. And I'm pretty sure it doesn't rain over here. I'm pretty sure. Because there's snow. <laughs> And there's also a little duck, which is so cute. Uh, but we could also build over there and then keep this island for the animals. What I think I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna recreate the world and build in both places and I'm gonna see where things look better. And I'm gonna try to pan out what exactly I want and I'll, I'll just figure it out then. How's my baby Zors? Ooh, he's getting big! Twinkle butt! You have a very twinkly butt. You do. Oh, we got some fur. Can we do something with the fur? Oh, we can make armor. Would this be Christmassy? I don't know. I think I have some fur, actually. Uh, I have a lot of fur. <laughs> I have a lot of it. Let me actually see. Uh, can I make uh, a little chest plates? Let's go see. Um, I mean... It looks very warm, and that's that's a fact. <laughs> it looks very warm. Uh, let me go see. Uh, pants. N not that, but this. Uh, helmet. And some boots. We got one piece of fur left. Let me go and see how this looks like with the full set. Oh my gosh, this is actually super cute. <laughs> so cozy and ready for winter oh I, I kind of like it actually <laughs> okay I'll keep it uh, let me go put the fur the leftover fur we have over there uh, this over here uh, I have so much stuff I don't know what to do with all of this okay so I'm looking for the inventory pets and uh, we do have a few Christmas ones uh, we have the Christmas tree pet but it doesn't really show me a recipe and I wonder if it's because it's still November for me. But it's very late November, it's almost December. Just ignore me for, for wanting to celebrate too early. <laughs> I think that's the only one we have that's kind of Christmassy. We have the heart pet which is, you know, Christmas is all about love and sharing joy. Uh, we also have this one, Politically Correct Pet, which I have no idea what it does. Uh, but it's included in the holiday pet recipes. I guess we could make it. Uh, I'm gonna try to make the Christmas tree and see if it works. We need redstone, which I have so much of. Uh, we need gold. 
a diamond, and a cookie. I need to make a cookie, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I don't think I have any cookies. Do I have any cookies? Uh, no, I do not. Oh, I just need cocoa beans. That's all I need. Let's get some cocoa beans really quickly. We should actually make more of these cookies because it's fitting. It's fitting for Christmas. Uh, so we need the redstone on both side, sides. We need the cookie, we need the gold, and we need the diamonds. It does not work. It's probably because it only works on December. No! Okay, according to Twitter, this can only be crafted at day 14 of December, which is kind of crappy because I don't know if I'm going to be able to record then. I'm all about pre-recording, but I guess I can make it on my own and just play by myself, but it's kind of lame. Because I wanted to do it with you guys. It's okay, I guess. It's okay. Let me go put my armor away. And I guess now it's time we go get our wolf. Uh, we're gonna need some apples and we're also gonna need gold. And I'm very excited for this. I hope you guys are as well. Which one am I gonna pick? Who knows? And so, I think it's Basil who's selling me this deal. Yes, I'm gonna go get the donkey wolf. <laughs> Because if I remember well from the showcase, I'm pretty sure this wolf has a chest and he can hold things for us. We're gonna see, we're gonna check, but I'm really excited for this one. And to tame the donkey wolf, we're gonna need more apples and we're gonna need some bones. So let me see if I have any bones over here. I should have plenty. Uh, let's bring 10, just to be safe. And now let's go get some apples. We have a ton of trees over for this side. We have three apples. I think we have another apple tree over for this side. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Uh, I still haven't fixed this tree. <laughs> the creeper blew up such a long time ago. I still haven't fixed this thing up. Oh, we could rescue these guys. They are stuck. Here. Come on up. Come on up, guys. Uh, now I fell down. <laughs> Where's my apple tree? Is it more on the back? I'm so confused right now. Oh, it's right over there. I found it. Was this my apple tree? Or is this another apple tree? I'm not exactly sure. Because I thought my apple tree had more apples. And that one only had one. Where the heck is my tree? Why do I have such a hard time to find things in my own world? Well, uh, should I risk it with four apples? I don't think I should. I think I should get more. But I don't know where exactly I should get more apples. Oh, no, it's a sherry. We have so many sherry trees everywhere. Oh, there's a baby ostrich. Oh. I'm soon gonna have one. No, that's a sherry. I thought it was an apple tree. It's not. Let's go back to my own apple tree and I'm gonna see if I have some apples in my chest. Even though I don't think I have. Because I used them all to tame my donkey. The real donkey. <laughs> I think Twinkle Bud is fully grown. Wow. Uh, I think this apple is also ready to be harvested. Yes. Uh, what apples do I have over here? Well, eight. This should be more than enough. And if it's not, I'm gonna be really upset. Uh, let's tame uh, the donkey wolf right next to our own donkey. Because that's gonna be cute. So right over here. Hello, buddy. Uh, let's spawn the wolf. Oh! <gasps> It does have a chest! I still didn't make the bones. I am very, very sorry about that. But here they are. Yes! One, two, three, four, five. Five bones. I made just enough. What? You are so cute! Look at them! I wonder if we can put a chest in this donkey over here or if it's just in the mule? I'm not sure. But come on up, buddy. Come on. Yay! Oh, how do we 
Oh, I see. Can you carry some cookies for me? That's so cute. And we can shift click him? No. I'm gonna have to figure out a few things about this mod. I think I'm gonna be ending this part here. I hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah, I mean, we're getting ready for Christmas. It's just a little bit early. <laughs> for me, it's gonna be early. For you, it's not gonna be early. But I hope you guys enjoyed this part and until the next one, goodbye everybody.